Welcome back to Fitness with Faith. I really want to make merch, which me and my mom were talking about it, but I feel like nobody would buy it. So comment down below if you want some merch because we might do Fitness for Faith and change the name for that, but I want to do Fitness with Faith. But it would sound better if it was Fitness for Faith because we could do like FFF, but I think I'm going to do FWF. That's going to be my symbol, yo. But today we are doing another workout video. Yes! So today I'm actually telling you guys the exercises and how to do them. Because in my last video I just showed you the exercises and didn't explain how to do them or what my techniques were. So yeah, let's just get into it. Woo! Okay. So I was wearing a shirt, but like... It's not good, and it's literally underneath. I and this, it's literally underneath this, but you can literally see everything. So I changed into this. So you're gonna want to get some nice, comfortable um workout wear. You don't have to wear shoes unless you're doing this outside. So that's why I'm not wearing shoes. But I just um have a basic tank. You could use like. A tank top, I'm just using a shirt. Um, you probably are gonna want leggings or shorts. Shorts are personally better for me. In my last video, I was wearing leggings. So you can wear either. Shorts are better because you can breathe more and it gives you more air throughout your body. And you could also wear a sports bra with some shorts or leggings. You could wear shoes if you want, I'm just, not going to but this is what i'm wearing it doesn't match i promise i have better style <laughs> okay so yeah let's just get into the workouts so we're gonna make this perfectly timed we're gonna do the these jumping jacks instead of jumping we're gonna go to the side to the left to the right and move and we're gonna do it the different way each time you're gonna do it 15 seconds Okay, now we're going to keep our body moving, and this is going to be a 10-second um, um, breather moment, but we're going to keep our body moving. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, now we, you guys are going to pause the video and do 15 more minutes. Um, 15 more seconds of jumping jacks, but I will not be doing that just to make this video a little shorter because it's the same thing. Do the same kind of jumping jacks that I did before. But now I'm going to do a different thing. Now I'm going to do these and their um, knee ups. I do them at school. You put your hands behind your head and you don't want to put your head down because that will um, hurt your neck you want to bring your knee up so then it doesn't hurt your neck so you're just going to go like that 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 it's okay if you can't bring your knee up too high um i can't really bring it up that high so just do whatever is best for you one two Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, I think we're good. So now we're just gonna do um, five seconds. One, two, three, four, five. Now we're gonna move on, and you guys are gonna do it one more time and pause the video. But if you guys don't wanna do that and you just wanna move on, you guys can totally do that. But now we're going to go into the next exercise, which we're going to move our mat up a little bit more to do it. And we're going to go like this. We're going to put our hand down, 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 lay down, and go like that like you're a superhero. Go back up, go back down. That, you're a superhero. 
one, two, three, four, five. So that's all I'm going to do because they do take a little bit more time. So you guys are going to pause the video and go do five more. But I'm just going to go on, move to the next six exercise. You can do five second warm up. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, now we're done. Now we're going to do another floor exercise. We're going to get down. We're going to do a um, um, a sit up, not sit up. I forgot what they're called. Where you go like, yeah, I can't do them. So this is what you're gonna do. You're gonna go like that and put pressure on your knees. And you're gonna put your leg back, put your arm out and, and switch each time. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So you're just gonna do twelve right now, you guys. Um, go ahead and do, um, um, go to, um, just go to the teams and do whatever number you want. So now we're going to do a 10 second warm up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, now we're going to go on to, pretty sure this is the last exercise, and we're going to go down and do sit-ups. I'm not good at these, but I'll get better at them. And then you're going to, okay, let me show you how to do them. So I'm going to do it from the side. Sorry. So you're going to go like this and this position and then you're gonna lay back put your arms right here and then when you go up you're gonna stop when you get to your knees then you're gonna go back down you're gonna do that ten times one two Okay, you guys are going to do it for the next five seconds, five times, and pause the video, do it for another five times, and then you're done with this exercise today, and now we're going to do a little bit of talking, because I like talking to you guys, and I think I'm going to talk at the end of my videos, sometimes, not every time, but today we're going to be talking about how to have a good, um, how to get your cravings in, but not eat bad things. Because you don't want to admit to your cravings. The only time you should ever admit to your cravings is at least once every couple weeks or once every week. It depends what your goal is. But an amazing way to stop your cravings if you have a sweet tooth. To stop your cravings from being from having a sweet tooth, you can just get some um you can just get fruits because they're super duper sweet and they're not unhealthy. 
there is some fruits that you should watch out for, which I'm going to tell you in the next video, which is the fruits that you should buy. But, um, and then for like breakfast, have like some yogurt. Well, you could have cereal, but I don't personally, I personally don't really, I like cereal, but I don't think it's the healthiest choice. Um, another thing that you could do it to, um, solve your cravings if you have like like you like tr chips or you like to hear like I know like m some of my family members they like like the sound of the crunch and they like the texture of it it's weird but that's what grips if that's what you like and that's what chips then you can switch that over to have nuts I really love almonds and it's a better way than chips or you can get Almonds and nuts aren't the same thing as chips. So you could get some healthy chips, like just some plain chips, and have it with some good dip. So I'm going to talk more about the food in the next video. But I am going to be posting every day, probably not on Saturday and Sunday. I will try. But yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed that video. Peace. Bye. Love ya.